We're here at the, the site of the Enclave. Um, it's a development in Ingersoll, Ontario. Uh, the developer is Warren Sinclair Homes. And uh, we had the opportunity here to uh, uh, introduce uh, low impact development uh, techniques. Um, this was a perfect site for it. Right now we're on the east side of the, the, par the property, which is uh, the access points for the development. Um, along Ingersoll Street. Now this whole area here along the frontage will be bioswales. Um, they'll be interconnected uh, and, and there also there'll be drops, right? So they're kind of a interesting uh, technique here. We had to do a, a large, you know, bioswales with, with drops in them. Um, they'll interconnect to the storm system um, and this will go all the way down uh, this property line so it allows for the runoff from the driveways and the entrances and also uh, picking the right plantings uh, to uptake the salts and, and the runoffs uh, both for winter and and what have you so uh, to help you know water quality uh, here on the site as well. So far it's been quite a learning experience for us we've uh, we didn't really know much about it to be honest going in and uh, our engineers made the suggestion to to explore it and and it's actually looks like it's going to bring a lot of value to our project uh, it's going to add to the overall features with the gardens and and the 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 outlook or, or the appearance of of everything I think is going to look really sharp I think low impact development adds uh, it adds a lot of value to the customers in in that their project is sustainable. It's it's somewhere that they can invest their money in a home and uh, and know that uh, everything right down to the to the rainwater how it's being dealt with is looked after properly. There has been a little more cost up front, but we feel in the construction side of it and in the long term maintenance the cost will be significantly less.